Top 10 Creepiest Things Found in the Woods Hey there YouTube, tell me something, have you ever wanted to drive down a dark road all by yourself or with that one friend who turns into a chicken when you see something scary? Yeah, me neither. Hey, either way, these people did and they got the scariest things on video. Before we go on with the video, however, I'd like to ask you to hit that subscribe button. pretty easy and honestly you'll get a whole bunch of different content from us here over at the top five channel with all that said and done i'm your ever lovely narrator gentleman t-rex let's begin shall we <laughs> number 10 is it bigfoot it seems like most videos these days are of people who think they've spotted bigfoot in the woods but have you ever seen an albino bigfoot the people of pennsylvania sure have and he doesn't play for the philadelphia eagles no this strange creature is said to roam the hills and woods of pennsylvania <laughs> People have told stories about spotting this creature since the 1930s, but it's finally been caught on camera. This creature is over seven feet tall, walks upright on two legs, and is covered in white hair. The albino Bigfoot moves extremely fast and makes loud, high-pitched screams while running through the woods. It is described as sounding like a woman screaming. Others say it sounds more like a panther. The creature is said to have no eyes and no ears. It almost looks like a humanoid or extraterrestrial figure that is found in caves and uh, drainage ditches. People who have seen it describe it as gray or a dirty white, shaped like an abominable snowman. As it glides across the camera, it almost appears as if it has no definable feet. It is a scary creature indeed, but rather than run toward the people to attack, it seems to run away as if it's afraid to get caught. It was spotted and caught on camera October 10th, 2015 in Pennsylvania. Alright, I saved the best for last, but first I have a quick challenge that only takes 5 seconds to complete. So if you can leave a like and subscribe within the next 5 seconds, you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. Just give it a try, it really works. Number 9. The Jersey Devil has lived in the Pine Barrens for centuries. For many decades, there have been stories and rumors of a creature located in the Pine Barrens of New Jersey. People claim to have seen it and captured it on film many times. Nobody's ever been able to debunk some of the more reliable pictures of the Jersey Devil though. The the creature looks like a bipedal creature with hoofs on its feet and wings, and many have described it as a goat with horns and wings. It moves very fast and lets out a blood-curdling scream. The Jersey Devil, or Leeds Devil as it was first referred to, is said to be a descendant of the Leeds family back in the 1700s. There are groups dedicated to studying and documenting proof of the Jersey Devil. A lot of their videos have made it online and on YouTube. Whether or not you believe it's true, people who live in New Jersey and Eastern Pennsylvania start locking their doors and keeping their blinds closed when stories of the Jersey Devil start making their ways around. Man size or larger than man sized dragon. Number 8. Is that a monster or did you photoshop it? In 2007 in Great Britain, people were finally able to capture actual footage of the Wessex Way monster. It is a monster that has been rumored to travel back and forth across the Wessex Way northbound motorway. Surveillance footage from a roadside camera managed to get documentation of the scary being a few years ago. People have been claiming to have seen this creature for years, but they were never able to get proof. This creature appears to be part human and part animal. It almost resembles a deer in its gait, but clearly you can see it's humanoid in nature. You can see what looks to be hands and feet, although it is galloping across the road on all fours at a very fast rate of speed. It actually outruns several cars on a busy speedway. It's able to jump high enough to leap over the road median without missing a step, and there's no way to know where it came from or where it goes as it crosses this busy highway. Number 7. Richard Gere couldn't find him, but these guys could. Another creature that wreaked havoc on West Virginia starting in 1966 is the Mothman stories, which have been written about him and movies have featured the Mothman. He's also been depicted in the new buggy game Fallout 76 as a gigantic moth. Not even really much of a man, just a gigantic friggin' moth. The residents of Point Pleasant, West Virginia described the Mothman as being about six feet tall with a barrel chest, huge wings, and no head or neck. Had a wide mouth. It has two red glowing eyes at the top of its chest. It makes a very high-pitched screeching sound as well, and terrorized the town of Point Pleasant for 13 months. This creature made an old munitions depot his home and would come out at night to torture and scare the people in town. After being sighted by over 100 people, the Mothman seemed to have retreated into his hiding space for good after a bridge collapse in Point Pleasant. He has started to make his presence known again along the east coast of the United States. He has also been caught on camera and video by several people, even as recently as 2016. Number 6. Old Woman and 
Russia. We have no idea whether this video is real or not, but it sure looks real. As the person holding the camera films, while on a horse apparently, he captures what looks like an old elfin creature or an angry old woman. The creature is coming towards him in the woods and is carrying a big stick. If it's an old woman, she is the ugliest person we have ever seen, and why is she carrying a giant stick? If it's a creature, we haven't seen anything like this since the Empire Strikes Back Ewoks scene. The person filming starts to run away as the old woman creature starts coming towards him, wielding her giant stick. Just what did she intend to do with the stick? We have no idea. Number 5. Is this a human, a monster, or a creature? It seems as if all of these videos involve someone driving down a scary, dark country road. Where else would we find ghosts, monsters, and creatures, oh my! In this video, Video, a guy was driving down a foggy dark road and thinks he sees something. Like all stupid people in a scary movie, he decides to stop the car to get a better look. When he stops the car, he sees a weird figure come out of the clearing on the side of the road and start to crawl across the trail. He has no idea what it is, and you can't really tell from the video what this creature is either. It looks like a humanoid creature on all fours, and it has a pinkish gray skin color and no hair. It also has an elongated neck and a bald head. As soon as it crosses the road, it thankfully disappears. Number four, looks like something out of that movie, The Strangers. This video looks like it could have been taken from a scary, creepy Hollywood movie. As the, As the driver heads down the road, you see these scary creatures emerge from out of the woods. As the lone man dressed in a black suit crosses the road, you see more creatures dressed just like him on the other side of the woods. He's carrying a briefcase and seems to have a white mask on his face, and as he scurries to the other side of the road, you see another guy dressed just like him, falling to the clearing on the right side of the road. As the driver slows down, he sees that there are about a dozen men dressed the same way, all carrying a briefcase. They're congregated on the side of the road and then seem to be shielding themselves from the driver's headlights. All of a sudden, you see a man in the middle of the road setting off a flare gun. As he does so, the men seem to scatter and the video ends. We have no idea what happened to the driver. Did the men kill him? Did they initiate him into a strange cult? Eh, sadly, you'll never know the answer. Number three. Is this a creature or a ghost? Eh, actually, never mind. Who cares? Just run. Like the old woman in the video above, this one also takes place in Russia. As the car drives down the scary dark road surrounded by the woods, because of course it is, you can see what appears to be a woman in white cross the road, because of course she does. She is wearing a white wedding dress with a long train trailing behind her. The woman seems to glide across the road without even looking back to see what's behind her. She has no fear of getting hit by a car. Is this because she died that way? The story is that a newlywed couple was driving down this same road many years before and got into an accident. The bride who was still wearing her wedding dress died in the crash, and her husband survived. They say her ghost now crosses this road every night at the time she was killed. Number two, chupacabras. There are several people in this world who have claimed to have caught a real chupacabra on film. But this one is the closest we can find of the real thing. A chupacabra is a strange four and a half foot tall monster who kills farm animals such as sheep and cow. They suck all of the blood out of the animal through three small puncture holes in their neck. The creature has red alien-like eyes that glow in the dark, and it has a feathered spine and absolutely no hair. It has recently been spotted in Texas, in both Houston and Ratcliffe, Texas. This video shows one caught on film in the woods of Houston. The second half of the video is a family who thinks they caught baby chupacabras, but Animal Control said it's just a weird crossbreed of a couple wild animals. Number one, a golem-like creature scares the bejesus out of a family. As a family drives past the woods in their car, they spot a mysterious creature watching the car as it goes by. The car had stopped just meters away from the edge of the woods, and the monster just stared at the family while the car was stopped before it quickly ran off. The creature was filmed in Canada. It kind of looks like a uh, golem from Lord of the Rings, if you think about it. It staggers out of a remote part of the woods before it runs back into the woods just moments later. It looks like the creature is walking on its hind legs, with its shoulders arched and its arms hanging lankily by its side. The creature itself is about six feet tall and appears to be hunting a moose on the side of the road by the wooded entrance of the forest. As the family wonders to themselves what the creature may be, they too comment that it looks like Gollum. You can even hear one of the family members saying, my precious, in the background. And that was our video for today, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video today, and if you did, well, it's your lucky day. For every single person that likes this video, you'll receive your very own tent so that you can spend the night in the woods. It's on its way to your house right now, and the delivery man will be dropping off in just a few minutes. Later, everybody.